pleasure to stay. I would now like to invite the Premier of Nova Scotia, the Honourable Daryl Dexter, to welcome Her Majesty. That will resonate for years to come. The diverse and extensive itinerary planned for your time in Nova Scotia, Your Majesty and Your Royal Highness, will provide an impressive launch to the Royal Tour in Canada. It will celebrate the service to country and community that creates, that creates optimism and opportunity for the next generation to enjoy a great future in our province. On behalf of the government and the people of Nova Scotia, I extend to Her Majesty and His Royal Highness our warmest and most enthusiastic welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Premier Dexter. Rollins Cross Attack Opagné was joined by the Dartmouth and District Pipe Band. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mesdames et Messieurs, Sa Majesté la Reine, Her Majesty the Queen. Monsieur le Premier ministre du Canada, votre honneur, Monsieur le Premier ministre de la Nouvelle-Écosse. Prince Philip and I are very glad to have returned to Nova Scotia today to begin this tour of Canada, my 22nd visit as Queen of Canada. My mother once said that this country felt like a home away from home for the Queen of Canada. Prime Minister, I'm delighted to report that it still does and I'm delighted to be back amongst you all. It has been 16 years since I was last here in Nova Scotia. There can be few places where the motto of 100,000 welcomes is put into practice with such conviction. Prince Philip and I are so very grateful to you all for the warmth of your greeting. La richesse de l'histoire et la vitalité de la culture des provinces et des territoires sont une source d'inspiration et une raison de célébrer pour tous les Canadiens. 
alors que nous commençons notre visite ici, en Nouvelle-Écosse. Prince Philippe et moi-même envisageons avec plaisir de participer aux activités soulignant l'histoire canadienne de service. Nous nous rappellerons la vitalité indéfective des migrants. Nous célébrerons le centenaire de la marine canadienne et nous serons témoins de l'esprit de bénévolat qui a contribué à l'édification et à l'épanouissement des collectivités et de pays. Canadians have, by their own endeavors, built a country and society which is widely admired across the world. I'm fortunate to be a witness to many of the developments and accomplishments of modern Canada. As Queen of Canada for nearly six decades, my pride in this country remains undimmed. Thank you again for your welcome. It is very good to be home. I would now ask you to please rise for the national anthem. Veuillez vous lever pour l'hymne national. Sung by, chanté par, Sidney Kane, Jamie Sparks, Sean Dowley, Lindsay Drummond, Norley Buchan, Carl Thomas, and Moneta James. Gentlemen, Mesdames et Messieurs, please stay in place as Her Majesty and His Royal Highness proceed uh, to the parkway to receive the next presentation. Vous êtes prié de demeurer en place pendant que Sa Majesté et Son Altesse Royale procèdent vers le côté nord du terrain. invite Mr. Logan McGillivray to offer flowers to Her Majesty. Mr. McGillivray graduated from Mason View Drive Community School in Bedford and will commence his seventh grade at Bedford Junior High this fall.